The biggest show on Disney Plus, the most recent chapter in the Star Wars universe. Season two has just started, and if you look closely, you will see a tri-state connection right there on the screen. In the most recent episode of the show, a major prop used was created by Owensboro native and Apollo High School graduate Caitlin Osborne. Spoilers, maybe ahead if you haven't started this new season, so we'll give you a sec. Okay, the child, or as some call it, Baby Yoda, is obsessed with eggs in episode two, which was released about a week ago today. Caitlin created those eggs. She's living in California now where she's a professional special effects artist and fabricator. She says this is actually now her second time working with this show. I did season one, episode two as well. Um, I worked on the mudhorn eggs. I fabricated uh, that, and I also helped fabricate the fur for the a section of the actual mudhorn where he pulls his vibro dagger out. They needed a practical piece for that, so I got to lay the hair and, and do all that. They were like, hey, we need this help for this Star Wars thing, and of course I jumped. Of course, like, I had to. So Caitlin's also had work featured on Captain Marvel, Jumanji, Next Level, and in the traveling stage version of Jurassic World, just to name a few. She'll have some costumes featured in the new Ryan Reynolds movie, Free Guy. With Hollywood currently in a holding pattern, she expects more work that we can see here at home. She just doesn't know exactly what that's going to be yet. So just remember, I got to tell Ron, she went to Apollo. Just keep that in mind. I actually graduated a year after me. She was in um, one of my middle school math classes, even though she was a grade below me. So it says either good, good things about her or bad things about me. No, she, she's brilliant and really cool to show off her work. And you can catch uh, possibly her work in the newest episode yeah. released today. Today.